Look at this. I got headphones <laughs> on. I got a mic going. <laughs> Baby. Huh? If only people could see you now. <laughs> hey, no video. We've gone through this before. All right, no all video. right, all right. <laughs> Welcome to This Commerce Life. This is a podcast aimed at small, medium entrepreneurs focused on commerce. I'm Phil, your host, and Kenny, your co-host, will join us as well. And we're going to talk to you about the world of retail and commerce and how things are changing in the world. <laughs> Good for me. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Worry, man. I'm not simple. Be a little thick, but oops, not simple. I'm not well, but like I, you got, you look disheveled. Do I? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Look, <laughs> why don't you get a full time job? I know, I know. We laughed at you pretty much the whole day. So did just, you? Yeah. Oh, yeah, of course. Well, that's what my friends are for. I live to provide merriment. Exactly. What do you want to be taken seriously? Come on. Listen, you got to hang out with old fogies. I I got to hang out with Shanae. So I had coffee oh, you with Shane today. Yesterday. Oh yeah, yesterday I had coffee. Oh, that's way better than what I had. I got a whole hour with Shane. I had Aaron and Jimmy. <laughs> mm-hmm. That's not even. That's not even. Now like who's a, laughing? That's not even like a hundredth of a Shane. <laughs> oh man, now who's laughing? <laughs> yeah, I got freaking burned on that one. Shane's <laughs> uh, Shane's coming on the show. She's gonna come. She do it. Yeah, yeah. She's in. She wants to do it uh, sometime in March. So we'll we'll figure it out with her. I'm thinking. Probably the week after I get back from Global, we can... Uh, When's that? Up. So a third week, maybe? Third week of March? Third week works okay, yeah, because yeah. Uh, I'm in... Um, When's Anaheim? Oh, oh shit. Yeah. Uh, yeah, the 9th, 8th, 9th, wow, something like that. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, uh, what's that called? Natural Health? The Natural Health, Health Expo. Uh, natural like this weekend, it's at CHFA. Like the Canadian Health Foods this weekend. Right, right. Yeah. So, so. Bit of a gong show, but that's okay. No, I was supposed no. to go to something tonight with, um, I'm going to bring Perrine on one day to the show because she's really sweet too. Okay. She's, she's another okay. broker friend, but uh, from a different perspective. Okay. Um, but she, well, I'm able to talk to her, but it's, uh, I was supposed to go to a, a networking event tonight, but last minute CHFA kind of project. You know what I mean? Like usual shit, right? Yeah. Small guys. It's all good. It's nothing. Yeah. And then I wanted yeah, to look so- for, uh, for Aaron tonight for Quest. And I then, some, uh, and then, uh, Expo West is five through nine, five through nine. Okay. Yeah. yeah. March five through nine. Yeah. Yeah. So I think we're going down on the okay. s- What's the fifth? The uh, Wednesday? I don't know. I just read out the numbers. I, oh, I don't Jesus. know. That's... I don't know where I am. That's okay. That's okay. Really? I don't know where I am. <laughs> you sound it, man. Uh, no, you it's know what? On. I, I, um, I'm just really. Full time Phil? No, you know what it is. It's it's um I actually really like it because I am like <clears throat> part of doing this is I've landed in the strategic marketing parts, which is what I really love. Um and so I'm stretching all those muscles, but I'm literally like the storyteller in me is in full stride now. Um so I'm trying I'm trying to find the story for Nimi. I'm, I'm, you know, our friend that we're working with, I'm, I'm trying to find his story, yeah. um, you know, into locate, we figured out her story, but now we got to tell her story. So I'm kind of like storytelling all the time, which means my brain is kind of like, I don't know, you know, like the only way I can describe it, it's almost like when, you know, you're songwriting or you're kind of doing something creative and like, you're just like, you're just stewing and mulling over it all day. And all of a sudden it's just like, Oh, I yeah. got it. Do you know, like, and then, and then you just got to go. Right. So tonight my, my daughter, um, I'm, I'm not Catholic. Right. But, but my wife is and the whole family is. And so she had confirmation tonight. Oh, nice. Yeah. Which is a really big deal. Right. But like at quarter well, five, Catholic. I'm like, look, I, I, I gotta go home. Cause I, I gotta go and do all this stuff. But at that very moment, you're like, Oh shit, I see the story. Right. So I'm like, <laughs> like, you know, I'm trying to type and like, like you know, but, but, you know, so I, I think that's where I'm, my head's at right now is I'm just, uh, I'm stewing over our friend's story because I'm, I'm missing, you know, when you're telling a story, like I'm missing that little bit um, yeah. to, to kind of turn the story around. And then with Nimi, I think I just figured out the little bit to turn the story around. So I'm just, you know, so my brain's <clears throat> kind of stewing. 
Um, okay, so doing good. So where are you at with the with our friend? What's the what's what's the? Where, maybe, I've got this, um, maybe I've got the match that I can just throw at you. Um, I you know what we've we've got a whole bunch of pieces. I mean, we looked at. Um, you know, we looked at the marketing plan that he had from before. It's yeah. pretty extensive. We think they missed the mark. Um, I think he, they missed the mark. So yeah. I'm, I've revised some of it. I also think it's quite lofty because there's like TV and things like that in there that I Not just like, you, Not know, happen. you know, just like, Not you gotta, happen. you gotta, you gotta know who you are, happen. right? Like radio could happen. Well, so it would be a magazine. Realistically, I, actually, I don't like it. You know, I, I think the happy medium here is, is um, like, I, I know a guy, um, I know a guy who does Facebook you know shorts. Yeah, I know, I know a guy I know who a does guy. Facebook shorts. I know a guy too. Um, so he does, he does like seven, seven or nine second Facebook shorts. So if you've ever Perfect. seen on Facebook, like the Benelin commercials, mm-hmm. um, you know, those sort of things, he does all those, right? And so those are, they're, they're expensive for a guy like our friend, but not, not bank breaking. Right. And it'll return yeah. him a lot of ROI, right? Like you're looking at like a, a five grand, you know, three to five grand kind of production sort of thing. Do you know what I mean? Like, but yeah. that's, that's a viable alternative where they're kind of like, you know, they propose like full TV and you're going, who, who does TV? Like, unless you're a top three brand, who does TV? <laughs> like that's like, you know, Who 50 grand, TV? like 50, 90 grand just to do yeah, production, TV. you know, without flight, right. Without like commercials and media yeah, and all that. It's not going to happen. So, you know, so, it's so it's a thought, $250,000 project. Yeah. To do decent, right? Yeah. 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 It's not going to happen. So that's kind of where I'm so at. You're thinking but, that, that angle. You know, yeah. So I'm, I'm taking that angle, but I'm also, I'm marrying it back to look, Here's here's the age group. Here's here's what you got to go after to kind of turn the profit, so you can go after your desired um, your kind of desired target market. And here's how you got to build the momentum to get there. Is kind of what I'm doing. Yeah. I'm stringing it all together. But sometimes when you're sticking slides together, is is when you go. This doesn't, you know. There's a leap here, and I got to figure out what yeah. you know. So there's some of that stutter stepping that I just got to smooth out along the way. So. Yeah. But I feel good. Like, I mean, usually when you're there, it is, you know, it's all in your brain, right? It's not, the alarm bells aren't there. Like if it were like today's Thursday, I kind of promised over the weekend, like if it's Thursday and I don't have not started the deck, you know, alarm bells should be going off right now. Right. So, yeah. um, you know, so yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's okay. what I'm doing. I'm, I'm literally, I'm, I'm stewing. I'm thinking about all this stuff. I'm, 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 you know, kind of planning and scheming and, you know, trying to, you know, my brain's doing jigsaw puzzles everywhere. Right. But, um, but it's good. I like it. I, I really like it. And, uh, I think actually the that, fun of it though, right? Yeah. 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 yeah it's, it's really funny because, you know, really in a lot of ways, you know, this full-time gig, we're, we're a startup, right? Like we really, we don't have anything, right? Like I'm constantly going, are we sending that to a customer? We're not sending it. Give, give that to me. Give me 30 minutes, right? <laughs> Cause I was just like, no, you, we can't, we can't send that. We can't say that. We can't send that. We they can't get to do that. We can't, we can't, we can't, you know, like, you know what? Propeller heads should not talk to people. I, in any form. You know, like, so this week we're, we're, we're about to, we've, we've got a major customer who wants to go speak to his counterparts about us. Right. So that's kind of a big deal, right? Is this, this, he's a, he's a global, um, pharmaceutical company. He's going to meet his counterparts from other countries. And all he wants to do the whole time is he's so stoked about our product that he wants to go there and talk about it. So, yeah. you know, and, and so our kind of internal response was, yay. And I went, whoa, no, like, how are you going to talk about us? Do you have stuff? And he's like, I don't have anything. I'm like, okay, so you got posters coming over. You got to leave behind on the table. We got you some swag. That's like super cool swag, you know, like, you know, we're going to get you a laptop demo. You you got to bring back the unit, but otherwise, you know, show. like, you Oh, like we're going loaded to bear. Right. And these guys are kind of like, what are we doing? Right. I'm like, you, you got to show, right? Like this guy's going to talk to like, he could be He's our bread and butter like for decisions. the whole year. Right. Like he could be our bread and butter for the whole year. Like yeah. someone could have a pen in their hand yeah. ready to cut. Yeah. Yeah. Cut right. And what's so, going to go with post notes? Yeah, I know. So, so it's funny. So we did all, so I did all this, right? Like, you know, um, pretty much by myself, right? Cause 
I'm in, right? Um, and then today, kind of the the kicker on it all is, you know, I'm I'm we're going through everything. They've got the demo, you know, with the laptop set out. My like, is there a case or something? What are we gonna bring the laptop? And they're like, well, we don't know. You know, maybe we'll go see if there's a spare laptop bag. And I was like, no, 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 <laughs> like no. So I walk down. We're we're right around the corner from Mountain Equipment Co-op. So I walk down there. And I buy like the nicest, you know, kind of 35 liter bag I can find, right? Like, so this is like a 35 liter bag is kind of like your weekend away, you know, if I'm going on a two day business trip, right? But if I'm going on like a two day business trip, this is one that you could stuff in one of these bags and kind of be really happy. And they're like, holy crap, how much is that bag? And I'm like, it's not that much money. It's like a couple of hundred bucks. But you know what? This guy he's going to talk like you, you want him to keep this bag, right? Because absolutely, and it's a cool bag. No. Yeah. And, and it's a pharmaceutical, so I can't give him anything, but if I were to bring him the laptop and all of his paraphernalia in this bag, and when he comes back and I go pick up the laptop and I just got the laptop bag, that's okay. You know, like if it didn't come back with a bag, yeah. that would make me really happy actually. Right. And they're all yeah. like, can we do that? I'm like, what do you mean? Can we do that? Yeah, we're doing it. <laughs> <laughs> we're doing Absolutely. it like, why can't like, you do it for sure you can I do know. it you, know, like, yeah. you look like you guys you look like idiots otherwise yeah yeah, yeah like yeah, what yeah. are we gonna do put it in a, in a ziploc bag and just say here don't get it wet i think so i think we're gonna show up with a pile of stuff like kind of like here you go you know and i was like you know we built him faqs they're like well we kind of have all these technical documents i go look this guy he's a product sponsor he's not reading 18 High people level. you know High like level. he is going the the meeting is somewhere cool in France. Do you know what I mean? Like, I was like, this yeah. guy is not going to read 18 pages on his way to France. So what you want is you want him to have the weirdest questions as FAQs because when he gets those right off the bat, which you know he is, he's going to feel good because he'll go, these guys understand me. They gave me the right answers. I look like a smarty pants. Guess what I'm doing? I'm going to ride exactly. this all weekend, right? Yeah. Like that is, you know, exactly. anyway. So that's what I'm doing. Just breathe. It's like, like all it's over the place. place, you know, all it's over the place. place. So yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it's okay, cool. Though. I mean, you know, it's, it's, it is what it is. Right. So, you know, yeah, yeah. but it's good. Well, yeah. It's good. Let's see. Jumped in. You got to jump in. <laughs> right. You no, chose no, it. Do like, it. You know, it's not, it's not me. Right. Like right. I, I don't, I'm not going to ride around on somebody's salary and not do anything. Right. Like, well, and plus, honestly, better, I hate so to I'm tell better. you, but your, your name's attached to this shit too. Eh? Yeah. Yeah. Totally. Yeah. So you're either going to look like a complete numb nuts because you're the one that signs off on this stuff. Mm-hmm. So you seriously going to, you're going to, you're going to deliver a laptop with nothing but papers on top yeah, yeah, and yeah. cords and no. say here. Yeah. No, no. honestly. No, no, not at all. Not gonna, no, not no, the slightest. no, no. Yeah. So I mean, you and know, if actually, if you're smart on this one, Go back to Mountain Equipment Co-op, get 10 of those bags, go down to a silk screener in town and put the logo on the damn thing. Mm, I thought about that too, but I don't want to do that because I don't know what their rules are about sponsored product. Do you know what I mean? So in my I don't mind, know that either. I don't. Yeah. I don't. This way I create uh, an avenue where if he says, hey, cool bag, I'm going to give them back the laptop without the bag. I can say nothing. He's not going to do that. And it's, it's done. He's not going to do that. He may or may not. He may or may not. He's not going to do that. He won't do that. If it was branded, if it's branded, he would do it. Because a branded bag really to me has no value. Right. See, and that's what, how I look at it. As soon as you put a logo on it, Mm -hmm. uh, there's intrinsic value in the bag. I get it. But Mm -hmm. really it's got no value. Right. Right, to right, be right. depending how you do the logo too. If like you yeah, really yeah, make yeah. it big and bold, yeah. like if anything, it's got a detrimental value. It's a negative yeah, yeah. value. Yeah. If it's just the logo, it's a, it's a wash to me because what do you, what do you do with it? Yeah. Yeah. Right. I, I don't want to carry. I don't want to carry a bullshit yeah. logo around town. I'm gonna put craft on my back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And pharmaceutical reps, like obviously, they can't take. They can't take. I, I don't know if that would. I don't know if that would qualify as a take of anything anyway. There's really no monetary value at that point. There's nothing. It, it's not even in kind. There's, what is it? It's a nothing. Yeah. <clears throat> it's not cash. It's not gifts or tips. It's not yeah. tickets to a hockey game. It's yeah, not yeah, a dinner. Yeah. yeah. Like, what are you going to do with it? Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Sell it? Yeah, I don't know. Do you know what I mean? I don't know. Yeah. With, with logo? Anyway. Yeah. But we'll see. Well, I mean, we'll see where this goes. How would you do with it? Yeah. Remember all the local shit you got? What'd you do? I gave it to friends. You know why? They thought it was awesome. Yeah. I had yeah. golf shirts, but it was, you know, yeah. golf shirts with 
J and J or Jameson yeah, yeah. or Weber. I'm yeah, like, yeah. What the fuck am I going to wear yeah. that for? I'm not going to. I don't want to be a billboard. I have yeah, friends. No, no I also problem. don't. They, I don't want you to think I'm a rep for them either, right? Exactly. Like, <laughs> but exactly. you're right, though. I had lots of friends who were like, "Woo, these are awesome!" Like, oh, I had sure, you know, just loved it. Yeah, just take them. Right, loved it. So that's what I but, say because I. That's kind of my theory, and, right? Is, so my theory is the same, but the opposite is I thought if I give him a a bag that isn't branded, it allows him to like if he decides this is a wicked bag. I can use this as a daily carry to work. He can do that now. Whereas if it were branded with our brand on it, he might actually have to defend himself at work. Right. It's, it's kind of like, Hey, are you, did you take their swag? Yeah, like, you know what I mean? So I don't know. I mean, possibly, I don't know. I don't, I, and again, I don't know the rules. I, I, I'm a, I, I bet you the house, there really isn't a rule when you're talking that. Like I know some of our retail friends out there have rules on pens being left behind. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, okay, yeah, I mean, yeah. seriously, that's a little extreme. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, I mean, you I know, you a couple of the big guys, you can't even buy them you coffee, the right? Yeah, yeah. No, no, you can't do anything. Yeah. You leave a pen, they throw the pen at you when you're leaving yeah, to make sure yeah. they get it out of the building. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> yeah. yeah so that's I a little know. on the extreme side, and there yeah. are no rules on that. That's and I think, ridiculous. I think that with. <laughs> these guys are like global pharma is if I call and I say, Hey, listen, I'd like to send over a little thank you thing. They'd be like, thank you, but no, thank you. So I feel like in this situation where it's a bit gray, it would be okay. So I, I don't think, know. I mean, you're probably better the way you, I don't think it matters. Again, that the gift itself is really nothing. Yeah. Uh, you know, again, I, I, you know how, how rules are because it'd still be considered a gift. Yeah. I mean, a lot of people would do it. What do you call it when you, when you, um, you donate, but you donate it to a charity on their behalf? What's that called? I have no idea. Not a gift in kind. It's yeah. Um, yeah. Something like that. Yeah. I don't know. It was something else. I had that. I, I had that a few times when I was at LD. I had, I think it was one time. Um, it's a console with Kellogg's. And they wanted to pay. I said, you can't pay me. I, I can't, I can't get paid for yeah. I'm working for London. Yeah. I said, that's, it doesn't work that way. Yeah. Hmm. hmm. I don't know. Yeah. I guess we'll see. Anyway. Interesting. What about you? What's going on with you? Oh, I lost you. Kenny. That's Shaw Cable again, that piece of shit company <laughs> they are not my there friends are. <laughs> they are not my friends <clears throat> just get you know how i know they're not my friends they don't even listen to us because yeah, nobody's phoned me yet to bastards. stop yelling at me yeah bastards just just get linda to go in there and fix them she probably don't owns them the too yeah Gosh, she yeah. does she probably owns everything yeah i think so no anyway so it's been an amazon week i've been yeah. working on a plus pages Okay. Uh, I'm working on our friends' uh, stuff today. I've got to go in. Okay. Oh, yeah, it's all copy and and pictures and and trying to figure out how to lay it out and trying to make it look like we're not yeah. some schmoes from East Vancouver. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we're trying to That's look like cool. some schmoes from Toronto's east side, not Vancouver's east side. That's trying cool. to up the game, you know. Yeah, 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 yeah. Apparently, um, it's supposed to help. That's what they say. I mean, I sometimes yeah. think Amazon's full of shit as well, but you know what? They say it helps. And I think no, it's no, probably because content it on make it look more professional. Yeah, yeah. But it, but you it know, also then, helps because like half of <clears> half <throat> of the internet goes to Amazon to search for product, right? Um, that's so what I SEO thought too. So if I great. typed in the keywords and farted yeah. around with it, yeah. you know what? We've got good odds yeah. of, of coming up. Yeah. I mean, we've already got a couple of things. Like we have a couple of products that are selling well on Amazon. Mm-hmm. And if you do type them in, like oh, some of these are very like you have to type in the name. Mm-hmm. Once you type in the name, it's our, it's an Amazon feature, yeah. but it's our product that's showing. Nice. Nice. Like you're thinking, okay, that's honestly. So if yeah. someone is looking for that, clicks on that, we yeah. we are getting actually the sale. Yeah. Right. So so for those for the audience who's um, who's unfamiliar, right? So Kenny's talking about product pages and then you know so when you go to amazon.com.ca and you look up a product you know the um you gotta scroll down a little bit yeah so when you when stuff pops up in the results and then you click on one of those pages and start looking at it um that's what kenny's talking about right is is populating all of those descriptions and um you know there's there's kind of a science to it and there's an art to it right because you you want to 
it's almost like merchandising a store a little bit, except this is on a page because you, you want it to look attractive and, um, but also be filled with, you know, information that the internet control and search and kind of index you as well. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's not rocket science, but it, it adds up, right? Yeah. You know, and I do, yeah. I think, I think if it helps with a little SEO and if uh, Google picks up on it, because mm-hmm. as soon as you hit shopping, so if you are looking, for example, you know, if listeners want to try it, go type in something in, in Google and hit the shopping, not news, not all, not images, hit shopping. And mm-hmm. you'll see uh, a lot of what comes up, like, especially in the, a lot of the health, well.ca, yeah. which means I'm assuming someone's writing pretty, some pretty decent content. Yep. Because they're getting it. It's coming. It's not yep. sponsored. Yeah. It's, it's, it's raw and natural. It's yeah. Yeah. It's just fantastic. So I think, you know. <clears throat> yeah, that's pretty cool. That's, uh, yeah, I mean, I mean, that is, you, you probably don't spend enough time talking about that. The fact that you've got Amazon skills, it's kind of, a, I don't. you know, you, you no, no, I, I know how to open up Amazon. I can sign on. Yeah. I've got two step verification or whatever they call that. Woo-hoo. I got that. Okay. So two quite step. frankly, outside of that, we're not that sophisticated in Amazon. No, but, but you're is, writing I, I content. around with it. No, but well, you're writing yeah. A plus content. That's, that's kind of a big deal. Like, it's, like the number so, of people yeah. that don't have that, right? Well, first off, you have to be, you have to be on vendor central. I don't know if you can do it on seller central. Okay. Wait, you, wait. So, <laughs> so, vendor central on that. So, so what's the difference between the two? Vendor Explain central, vendor central in food, you have to be invited to participate. Okay. So you have to be, um, well, Amazon sends you an invite. Okay. Right. And you're on Vendor Central. What it is there is they control uh, pretty much all your world. So you set the retails and your costs, but if Amazon wants to go stupid on the retail, they go stupid on the retail. Right. The algorithms just run wild. When you're on Seller Central, you control your world. Okay. Not just the shipping aspect. So on Seller Central, you can fulfill yourself. You Mm -hmm. can have Amazon fulfill. But on Vendor Central, it's controlled by Amazon. Once you put it in, pricing is theirs. So the, whatever retail is determined by their algorithms. Okay. On Seller Central, you still control all that world. And then is there a... But you can still have Amazon fulfill. Yeah. Or you can do it yourself. So it, it really has nothing to do with fulfillment, right? That's a different thing. But nope, then because you can fulfill on both sides. doesn't matter. Right. right. And it's then really so... The, it's controlling the retails and controlling uh, how your page... Um, I guess it would even probably in terms of ranking. Mm-hmm. A vendor central page probably gets probably plays different in the algorithms than a seller central. Right, 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 right. right. Because Amazon's driving their own mechanisms. Exactly. It's, it's sort of right. theirs now. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So what it almost like the seller central to me is almost like you're going into a store and put on consignment. Yeah. And vendor cent or a vendor central, especially when they fulfill, they own it. So they cut more like goes, a classic retailer. It's, it's like know, a classic like, retail. And it's very insert, much like that. Insert. Take their margins, insert, their co-op. Yeah. Yeah. Their terms. Blah, blah, yeah. Blah, 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 blah. yeah. Right. Okay. Okay. Yeah. No, it's, Amazon itself is not, it's not, it's not, it's, it takes a lot of time and work to fart around with it. Yeah. Right. It's just yeah. a lot of work like Amazon. I mean, I, when I first started, it's like you're, you and your marketing people, I'm not even gonna be part of your group. <laughs> you marketing oh, people, it's like content's no. easy, content's easy, content, content. Amazon's like the, Oh yeah, I just go on Amazon. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you just go on Amazon. <laughs> 10 years nobody talks to you yeah like there's no people well there are but you have to get through oh, my layers, you have to get through what like 15 layers of robots before you get yeah, to a person come on how many you know how much you know not that well, much time. it's true and you know what you'll send things that periodically you get phone calls how was it are you okay so it's not that it, it's not a it's, it's just a beast yeah yeah so if people out there like i always tell people, if you spend time on amazon spend the time it's a lot of fun to play with. It's very powerful. It can really can make a difference, can yeah. make a big difference. But yeah. it takes time and effort. It's not, you know, it's not plug and play. Kenny, you got you got Amazon skills, man. Look at that. You just dropped us some Amazon knowledge. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put that somewhere in my world. Amazon. What's not? Give me a lesser than an expert. No, exactly. I, I, One of those guys. I know a guy. You are the guy. Now no, I know what I'm going to refer myself back I'm to. Must, I'm going to start sending guys to you. You <laughs> should take it easy. Yeah, I'll be like. You know, it's funny. I took over. I took over our friends today. I said, give me your password. Yeah. He goes, why? I said, I'm, I'm tired of this. Give me it all. I'm going to do it. Yeah. 
So it's, when I finish with you, I'm going downstairs and I'm going to start. That's hilarious. The pricey and I'm going to put some yeah. features on. I'm going to do some yeah. ads for him. Nice. And I'm thinking his. You better watch him. Next thing you know, you're going to be working for him full time. <laughs> not going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not like you. I will not cave. I thought I was relatively weak until I met you. you weak, Someone asked me the other day, goes, why, why did he go? I said, I think he's either got, got paid obscene money or I, he just can't say no. I said, I, I don't know what that guy is. I don't get it. It was just too compelling. They, I, told, like, I said, you know what I said? I said, you know what got him is that he's so full of himself. Like he, he knows he can do this and he's going to crush it, but he's so full of himself that he had to prove to himself that he actually yeah, I, I just had to go do it. Like I, I just... It's like, I don't know what it, yeah. you love it. It's like, you know what it is? It's like, it's like you, if you like to organize shit, right? Yeah. And then, but when you're in the middle of organizing, you go, look at this bullshit. This place is so messy, blah, blah, blah. But you freaking love it, right? Like, and I just it. can't. Oh, you love seeing the dust line being removed. I, yeah, I just can't. Get clean. I can't let it go. Like, I, I think I look at things and I just like, I walk by them and you're kind of like a normal same person to be like, this is yeah, not whatever. my life. Like I, I gotta like but whatever. I gotta get to where I gotta go, right? And and I'm like, you, yep. you're just, I'll be right back, right? <laughs> like, yeah, I, exactly. can, I gotta look at this. Can, you know, like, you know just, what? It's all good though, right? I like the it. problem is, you know what it is, Phil. I've got like I could. I mean, I can't work for anybody full time. I've I've really come to that determination. I cannot. I cannot. I cannot take a job. Yeah, I can't. I cannot yeah. physically work full time for anybody anymore. I, I don't even. I don't. Yeah. Like even I think if yeah. I wanted to, I don't think I can. I think the only reason I can is because my circumstances are very like, so I have a boss, but my boss is in the UK. So that's by almost the time, like without a boss there. Yeah. I mean, you know, cause by the time I get him, he's five hours into the job. He's tired already. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. I see him once a month. Um, there is no marketing person. So it's just me. So in a lot of ways, it's kind of like me. You know, and yeah. so it's kind of, I think that's the other part that made it highly irresistible was it's just me, you know, like I think when I start building out a team, you know, I'm going to get to like seven or eight people. And by that point I'll be like, I'm done. Right. Like I, I just yeah. don't, yeah. it's too much bullshit. Right. But yeah. at the moment, I think that is why it was such a perfect storm. Right. It's because it's yeah. like, it's startup. They got nothing. They know nothing. And they, you know, and there's nobody to kind of like get in my way. Right. So I just do what I got to do. Right. So, you know, like, you know, I like you know what it is. I don't think yeah. I can do this. I don't think I could do one project. I think that's my problem right now is I think I've gotten, I think the ADD part is so comforting that I just like yeah. not doing yeah. one thing. I think yeah. that's what it is. Yeah. I, I don't even know. So I don't that. I just don't want to work for anybody. I think, Actually, you know what it is? I think. Yeah. I don't know what I do half the time. So I think I quite enjoy. Someone asked me there, my internet's uh, unstable again. So I may have just lost you. No, there? No, no, I'm here. Yeah, I'm Still here. there? Yep. Um, I just, someone asked me, well, what do you do? And I said, you know, I don't know. Whatever. I said, a lot of times I go in yeah. and sometimes I, it's just sitting down for a couple, two, three hours and just listening to them, whoever yeah. it is, and just saying, okay, this is how I see it. Bang, 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 bang. And they're looking at you thinking, wow. You're thinking, no, it's not a wow. It's because you are so buried in the minutia. Yeah. And like you so live and breathe every yeah. nuance of this. And I walk in, I don't really give a shit. Yeah. With yeah. 90% of the, of the stuff that you yeah. think about is got sh shit to do with what really has yeah, to be yeah. done. Yeah. So I get to go right to the 10% and because my yeah. capacity in my head's not that yeah. big, it's easy. Yeah. yeah well, you're you an idea. 90% right? of the shit's yeah. not in there. Yeah. I just have to worry about the 10 and the 10 yeah. and it's not, and it, and I think that's, you just, it's just easy, right? There's a reason. That's why I think that, you know, the, this consulting thing is kind of cool because you can go in for short bursts and yeah. you can actually change. Yeah. You can really, ch you could, you could change the way people see it. You know, you have to be like you and I talked before. You don't have to be Joe Greedy and do you know fifty thousand dollar contracts nope. and you know, like nope. you know big five hours. You go in five hours, five hundred bucks, six hundred bucks, cheap, cheap. But it's yeah. amazing. People sit there and think, "Wow, yeah." 
Well, and the difference you can make, right? I, I think that's the other part, right? That's really attractive. Totally. It's just I love like, it. You really do. You, you get to people and, and they, you know, and then the five hours you spend with them, it really does. It really helps them. Well, it can change them. their world. You know, yeah, it changes, right? It's so, different than what you're doing now. Yours yeah. is a full-time gig, but you're not going to yeah. be a full-time gig for 10 years. No. You're probably going to be a full-time gig from 18 to 24 months. Yeah. You know yeah. what? And you'll get them to a point and then it'll probably get to the point where it is going to start getting political and you're going to have people yeah, yeah. that yeah. you have to manage and you're going to think, oh, yeah. I don't want to, I, I, yeah. I want to go back to, yeah. you know, I want to go back to the fun stuff. Not yeah. This is work. It's right now you're farting yeah. around. You're doing shit. Yeah. Well, well, my life, my life is, oh, is not that different from yours, except that geographically it's in one place, right? Exactly. So I'm not running around as much, but honestly, like day to day, it is, it's all about that, right? Like we're, I'm looking at stuff, you know, I get pulled in all sorts of meetings where half of it is like, blah, 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 blah. And we send this to customers. I'm like, what, wait, what? No, stop. Yeah. What, what do we, we send that? Uh-uh. <laughs> That's not going to happen. And they're looking, thinking, it's all, and you know what? It's perfect, yeah. right? Content yeah. spot on. It's all there. And you're thinking, no, no, no. Yeah. That's a packaging is disgusting. No. We're going to repackage. It's got Excel purposes. grid lines. Nobody yeah. sends Excel grid lines to any customer anywhere. Yeah. It should be a rule. Like Grid lines you use like, at home when you yeah. can't see anymore. Yeah. I like grid lines. You know, like, yeah. My customers don't need to see grid lines. No, never. Or if you're going to grid line it, just the content, bold yeah. the outside, maybe bold a few columns. Yeah, so it yeah. looks like you actually did something. Yeah, yeah. You actually, you know, you just hit the format button, right? But you know, you gotta like if you're a listener of ours, don't use grid lines ever to send anything to a customer ever. Yeah, try not to not send ever. it to it. It just it does it just ever, looks ever. Yeah. I like it when I'm working. I, I yeah. first thing I do is put the grid lines in right yeah, away. Because it's comforting. It's comforting. Exactly. Because I, I know it, what I'm building, you know. And it confines my little yeah. world. Yeah. And then I go back and delete them and then I just grid line what I'm actually yeah. working on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Cause sometimes that does look a little cleaner. Oh no, it totally does. Yeah. Totally. So yeah. grid lines when you send, but yeah. only the stuff that needs yes. to be grid lined. Yes. And if you can bold grid line, bold Even it better. in the spots. Even it just better. looks like yeah. you did shit. Yeah. Format it, people. Formatting matters. It does. Oh, my God. Think of how you'd like to see it. Yeah. See, that's yeah. the problem with propeller heads. They get all excited about the tech. And you're thinking, yeah, yeah I, that's, that's awesome. You can't do it this way because it looks mm-hmm. horrific. Mm-hmm. Horrific. Yeah. You know, think of, think of the Apple. Think of all the Apple products. The reason they're so – it's not that the guts are, are – the guts are decent, but they're no yeah. better than anybody else. You know, they package it amazing. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It comes out good. Yeah. So anyway, counts, man. Anyway, that's that's kind of yeah. I, but I do. I think the best part about what I'm doing right now is I am, I'm doing the thing that I love the most, which is storytelling. Right. Like, so, and so that's awesome, that's man. Just like, you know, yeah. So my brain's kind of in overload because my brain's like, woo! I'm doing this. I'm doing this all over the place. Start telling stories. Start telling stories. Right. So, and how cool is that? Like when you do shit that you really like doing. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. Like seriously, that, that's, yeah. I mean, that's a, that's a yeah. treat. It's, it's, um, so I think, I think the implication to when I return to full freelances, it's, it's probably going to mean that I'll never, ever, ever pick up a bread and butter sort of account unless I really, really have to. Do you know what I mean? Like, yeah. so, so I guess what I, you know, like the day to day, you know, kind of, I've got to slog it out sort of accounts. I'll probably never take again. It'll be, you have a problem with your, the way you perceive, you know, people perceive you or the way that the brand is. Um, <clears throat> so you're going to come to me cause I'm going to help you fix it. Um, yeah. and then once we're done, we're done. Like, yeah. you know, I've helped you tell your story. I'm off. Like I'm going to do something else. So, yeah. Um, I, I don't, I think it's, it, you know, I, yeah, I think that's the way to do it. I think at the beginning you don't, you do it the opposite way because you need that sort of yeah, income and you need, need to money. balance yeah. out. Yeah. Once you start establishing, yeah, I think, yeah, 10 days on the high side. Do mm-hmm. you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. High, high side. Mm-hmm. Otherwise, those five and 10 hour contracts in and out, I think are just, they're just fun. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Right? And if yeah. someone needs it, they can always call you back. And yeah. But, but I, I think, even think for them, it's, it's yeah. fun too, right? Yeah. Yeah. And I think it's revealing. Like, I think that was something that I, I don't think, 
you know, cause I, I kind of always saw myself as someone I can do all of it. And I, I thought I liked doing all of it and kind of getting my sleeves rolled up and getting into it. And then I think now what I'm realizing is, yeah, I can do it and I don't mind it every now and then, but you know, it's not that's really. probably why you're like, that's probably why you're liking this one because yeah. Yeah. every department you know, you're in one building. Yeah. But if there's 10 departments, it's like 10 different clients because none of them know what the hell yeah. they're doing when it comes to your yeah. stuff. Yeah. Right. It, it's, it's an old phrase. The, uh, I don't know if you ever got that, but it's really old now, but, um, in organizational behavior, they call it forming, storming and norming. Did, did you ever, did you ever get that? So, no. so there's, I, I don't even, I'll have to look it up like and kind of reference it in, in the podcast notes or whatever, but but one of those organizational behavior experts, um, you know, talked about how organizations are, are set up. And so like the early days of everything is, is what you call forming, right? So that's like the starting of the, you know, what does things look like? What does shapes look like? And then storming yeah. is when you've got conflicts and you're trying to work out process. And then norming is, okay, we figured it out. We've got to template it now. So it gets normal. Right. And I think, for me, the process of forming and then storming is probably where I love it the most. Um, and then the norming is, is really, you know, that's sunset for me, right? Like that's like yeah, the boring. Um, boring. Yeah. It's boring. Yeah, boring. Like, why do you want to yeah. be in the norm? Yeah. I don't know. Like the form and the storm is where you want to be because that's where the fun shit is. Like by the time you hit norm, you know what you're just looking at think, Okay. Well, yeah, I've been there, done yeah. that. Yeah. yeah. Like I, I, I can right. go away now and do nothing and it should yeah. run by itself. Right. So I yeah. should probably just go away. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we'll yeah. see how long this gig goes for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. It's, uh, I think this one's got some legs. This one's this one's interesting, and and uh, I'm yeah. into I'm into stuff. I'm I'm helping to kind of shake up the investor deck and all that kind of stuff too. So it's it's uh, it's pretty interesting. So yeah, yeah. We'll see. It's cool though. We'll see. That's cool, right? Yeah. It's, uh yeah. No, I, I, that's, that's, yeah, at least you're, you're having fun at least, right? It's, yeah. You know, it's all good, right? Yeah. It's all good. Yeah. Man. It's all good. And it how's is. our, how's, uh, how's Shanae doing? She's great. She like She's great. She, uh, unfortunately for her, she was in Toronto during the vortex. Um, oh, so she was like, oh my God. So the, like, so when I saw her yesterday, it was like minus two or minus four here. Uh, and I said to her, it's like spring out here. And she's like, ah, you know, now whatever people, she said, you know, back home in, in Vancouver, we're getting a little bit of snow and everyone's freaking out. And she's like, please people, if you only saw what it was like on the other side of the coast, like whatever. Right. Oh, <laughs> was like, <laughs> oh, like a couple visits to we've already lost her. Right? Like, I know. Oh my God. Maybe she's not allowed on the show now. <laughs> One Torontonian per episode is more than enough. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. But it was good. She's doing okay though? She's good. She's good. Yeah. 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 So we office we talked, is set up. Yeah. Office is set up. She's, she's uh, off and running. And then, and then we talked about her getting on the show and, um, you know, talked about, um, Oh, we talked about all sorts of things. We talked about, you know, she, she and I are going to try and figure out if she might be a good fit for us as well. Um, so maybe she can, oh, some, uh, awesome. I know. Right. So, so just lots yeah. of dialogue about, you know, what the product, so if any of our listeners, if you're looking for a really good, you know, yeah. PR social person, Vive social PR. Yeah. Yeah. Just look it up online. I think it's, it's vivesocial.ca or vivesocial.com. Uh, I don't know. Yeah. Just look up Vive. So V-I-V-E. Yeah, just look up Shanae, Shanae Liam. Yeah. yeah. So V-I-V-E, right? right? So V-I-V-E socials. Right. Um, and Shanane, S-H-N-A-N-E, uh, Liam, L-I-E-M, right? L-I-E-M. Yeah. yeah. She's so, awesome. Just hire her. Don't even bother. Don't ask for a quote. It's not good. worth it. Just do it. Yeah. And yeah, they're, they're cool. really fluid. Like they do socials. They do PR. Um, they, do, they do content creation. So if you need graphics yeah. for socials, they do that too. Yeah. They also write video, um, picture, yeah, video, picture, like and they write a lot of article stuff. content as well. So yeah, um, yeah. So it's a talented group. Things, so yeah. yeah, 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 right, yeah, yeah. Free plug. That was our free, yeah. Our free That's plug. worth it, man. Yeah, yeah. Linda gets enough free plugs, so it's time. Well, Shane gets a free plug. Love tonight. you, Linda. 
We love you, Linda. Oh, I'll be back. Thank you, Linda, for oh, coming on the show. You know? Yeah, yeah. That was fun last week. Yeah. I, I liked doing it with Linda. That was good. Yeah. Jimmy, I, I saw Jim today, who we love yeah. too. Mostly because we like Lori, but that's that's yeah. a whole different story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we, I was telling uh, Jimmy, and he goes, yeah, I, I, how, how did you get her on? I said, I said, you know what? I think we've probably just rided her so much on the show. Like, I think she <laughs> her voice. And I said, but honestly, it was one of the fun, that was one of the most fun yeah. ones that we've done. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mostly because you know what it is? I don't know what she does. Like I know what she does. Yeah. But I don't know. I don't know. I don't know the production yeah, side. The nuts and I love and, yeah. I just like getting into the into that yeah. that shit, right? And yeah. it's, got, it's got such a good thing going. Yeah. Right? Yeah, it's just yeah. a good thing. Yeah. It's pretty cool. So. It's pretty cool. We should um Jimmy's a guy that we should have back on because he Oh, hundred percent. When we met him, he was just starting down these paths and now he's kind of got yeah. this whole new side of diamond side quest today. business quest. And yeah yeah but he's got the yeah. classic side of the business but he's also got all this he's doing all you know, he's on he's on facebook socials now he's he's doing coaching. facebook live and he's coaching and i think that's more lori though yeah don't, well, i don't don't give Jim too think, much credit i, I think, think that's more lori i think we just Actually, you know what we should do forget Jim. we should just have lori on <laughs> We actually, we, the Lori, for? Lori, we, we actually, I think we talked about that at one point was getting her on to do some coaching. Um, you see, that would be, what's Jim going to tell us? Like, really? Come on. But the only thing is, Lori's Lori way might, smarter than Jim is. Lori just might tell us we're both crazy, which. Well, we all know that. Yeah, yeah. But I think it would hurt more coming from Lori because we really like Lori. So. Plus, we'd actually believe her. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, maybe we'll go back to Jim. Uh, I'm <laughs> it's just easier to manage. I know, I know. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm not going to do that. Yeah. <laughs> She'll make us look bad. And we'll it doesn't to, take much to make us look bad. We'll have to figure that out. But we, we, we should have one of the Shoplins on. And we should talk I about I would like that. to have Laura just because I, think, I like the coaching yeah. things she's doing. Like, yeah. I just, I like the, um, I, you know what it is again? I think, it, especially when we're talking like our entrepreneur friends yeah. and small business, yeah. it's just, it's, it's the breath of air. Like, breathe. Yeah. Take just relax for a second. Yeah. Then you go. Yeah. yeah right. Yeah. yeah. And yeah, I think I it's out of the business because again, it's sort of the fluffy side yeah. of what we do. Like we're yeah. already fluff as it is, but yeah. it's not because it's that grounding. It's really important. You know, yeah. it's, it, it's to find your core and just okay, breathe. Yeah. Stop. Yeah. What's this doing? Why are you doing this? And yeah. you know, collect your thoughts for a minute. Yeah. Cause you know what entrepreneurs are like, it's just, it's, 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 no, it's, just, it's you, chaos. Yeah. Yeah. You just go. Yeah, so Jim's off. Lori's on. Yeah, sorry. That's all. But, but Lori, when you hear this, shoot us a note and uh, yeah, let's set a time. We'll figure it out. We'll we'll set a time and get you on. It's a good test to see if she's actually listening too. I know, right? I know, right? Might be Christmas it's, before she. Uh, they, they, you know why? Because they all say they listen. Ah, I'm not convinced yeah, they listen. Yeah. Well, the first step is for them just to download it, and then <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and they got to get to minute. What are we? Minute forty? Uh, yeah. I don't know, man. <laughs> Well, they might just go play and then drag to the end. But, <laughs> but they got to know to do that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. See, right now you got to wait so long before you get those deets. You do, you do, you do. Well, All right, Lori. Awesome. When you hear yeah. when you hear this, um, shoot us a note, and uh, we'd love to have you Let's on. Do it. Um, the, do it. I think the audience would really benefit. I, we definitely would benefit from you. Well, but we I would benefit. Like Remember, even if the audience doesn't, like we yeah. would. Yeah, yeah. more help probably than all of our listeners yeah i think so i think our listeners know that already too so yeah i think yeah I think you're probably right yeah well you know what it'll be a good test to see if we can actually improve can't get much worse i've had 53 years to get to this level of incompetence right i mean i i, I, not, I can't go much farther behind <laughs> I, as low as we can go i think i think the worry is that Lori's going to point out that what we think is worse is actually much worse do you know what I mean? Like, because I Oof. think we feel like we're at the bottom of the barrel. We're back to having Jim on. Yeah, but, we're back to she, having Jim on. Then. Yeah, but she might just go. Listen, you think you're here, but you're actually like. <laughs> well, I don't want to be told that. I mean, I know, but I mean, I, I can know. laugh about having a low bar, but Jesus, yeah, she might out. actually confirm we got a low bar, and then that's that's. Oh my God. Anyway, we'll need we, we've we've issued the invite. So so Lori, yeah, let's do it. When you hear this, uh, shoot us a note and we'll, we'll get you on the yeah. show. And, and let's uh, book a time because I think yeah. it'd be great. Yeah, and I, I think, think so. it'd be a real benefit to a lot yeah. of our listeners. Yeah, I think so. A lot of listeners. I think so. Yeah. yeah. Awesome. Amazing. All right, sir. Yeah, that's all I got, man. I got nothing else for you either, buddy. Yeah, uh, I, I, got, I got nothing else. I'm, uh, have a good weekend. I'll wait for the marketing stuff from you. 
I will, yeah. Yeah, and, yeah. Uh, and away we go. Yeah. Away we go. All right. That's the end of this Commerce Life. We'll be back soon with the next episode. Thank you for joining us. We hope you enjoyed it. Uh, give us feedback. Tell us what you think. Subscribe, like us, join us, share us, tell your friends about us. And uh, we hope to see you next time with uh, with more commerce news.